Oh my! What do you mean run? Was it not in front of us? Yes, it was. Chris, you have no instincts. Oh, you're pissing me off. Then run. What's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are back with another Until Dawn part. I think it's part 7. Oh, this is Loki perfect. You can already see him. I gotta introduce y'all to my new cat. He is an adorable little guy. He's so sweet. I haven't really decided a name yet. Look at him. He is so adorable. And he is the sweetest little kitty ever. I love him so much. He has a little Naruto headband collar. I don't know if you can really see it. I don't want to hurt him. Yeah, he is so sweet. I love him so much. Okay. Anyways, back to the game. Um, where do we leave off? I don't even remember. Oh, so Josh revealed himself. He's the killer. We know that now. And then we left him in the cabin with Mike, which I do not agree with at all. Uh, and Chris went back to the to the place by himself. And oh, and then Emily was left with this guy. Did she run? Oh, okay, no, 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 no. We're okay. Hey, he's chill. He's chill. He's chill. He's chill. Use these. Get the hell out of here. Yeah. Now. Emily, you gotta stop being so clumsy. Oh, shit. Come back with Emily. Oh, I killed Matt, by the way. Uh, Jess might be dead. I don't really understand how I killed her if she is dead. I'm gonna have to look into that at the end of the game if she doesn't come back. Alright. What did he give us? I don't even- I didn't even see what that was. Exploring, exploring, exploring. Greetings from Calgary. Billy Bates, Blasting Crew, Northwest Mines, Alberta. Hey Billy, I had a great time. Look me up here if you're ever in Calgary. Loretta, XXX. Ooh. <laughs> Type shit. Oh! I don't think that was a human. I I don't think that was a human at all. Mmm. Blackwood Mines, this area of the mine has recently suffered structural collapse. Please contact Foreman H. Tanner. Okay, that gives me nothing I fucking care about. Uh, anyways. Let me make sure I don't miss a player gun, right? <laughs> Fuck this game. Man, these graphics are nice. Look at her jacket. That shit has so much detail. Right, I guess we're jumping down. How was that ankle doing? I thought your shit was fucked up. Nah, right, you ain't getting me. Let me go this way. There's gotta be a totem or something. Or maybe this is the right way? No, oh, but there's a totem. There we go. Damn, that took me fucking forever. Wait, what? Mike? Fortune. So don't shoot? I think he's pointing a gun. So don't shoot whatever they're talking about. I think from what I've learned is that a lot of these situations in this game, unless they're gonna mix it up, is if you can attack something or shoot something or do anything to something, you shouldn't do it. It's kind of what they've been showing us, so I'm gonna try to stick with that as best as I can. And if it gets me killed, uh, that's too fucking bad. Can we talk about how this flamethrower guy is Batman in this bitch? It's just running around with a flamethrower 1v1ing all the Wendigo. <laughs> like, what the hell? <gasps> Emily! Oh, you're tweaking. Why did you look away? That thing is fucking huge. I don't like that at all. What is that? Is that another, to another tunnel? Damn. Whoa. That one looks cool. I don't, I don't even have the flare. Okay. Okay. okay, well, good thing I don't have a fucking flare, so that's not gonna do shit for me. That was a danger totem, so that's- Is that not right here? Okay. Okay. It's literally right here. What do you mean? No, 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 no. That didn't teach me shit. What do you mean danger, but you're not- Okay, I guess I gotta be ready for danger. I don't. 
out of... Run! Oh, shit. Go! Oh, oh, shit. Do you see it crawling? That shit is fast! Oh. Oh, no. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. What do you mean, left or right? The elevator is the only thing pointing me somewhere. I'm going left. I'm sorry, Emily. If I get you killed, I'm so sorry. Why would there be a sign pointing this way if I wasn't supposed to go this way? Fucking hurry! Okay. Oh god. I feel like she's dead. Is she dead? Why else would there be a sign saying surface elevator? Why else? Oh no, why did you throw the fucking torch? The only thing helping you? Oh, Emily! No! Oh my god, my actually clicked square! I didn't mean to do that! She had the flare this whole time? Okay, I don't think she's dead from that. She's kind of cooking. Oh my gosh. I can't, I can't do this. I can't do this. Leap or stay on? Was there a total for this? Oh, that's her getting fucking killed. Dude, there was no total for this. I don't know what to do. I don't even know what that's from, but that's Emily again. Her getting blown up by some shit. I still don't get how Jess is dead if Jess is dead. That's such horseshit. Dude, I don't know what to do. Oh, man. I really want to look this up, but that's pussy shit. Oh, man. My gut is telling me leap off and just get away from here. So I'm gonna go with it. Fuck it. If she dies, she dies, bro. I don't even fuck with her like that. Oh, this is not what I thought it was going to at all. Oh, I think she's dead. Oh, Emily, I'm fucking sorry. I thought they meant, like, leap off and go somewhere else. I don't even have a reaction to this. Please make it! Please make it! Yes! Oh my gosh! Holy shit! Is she gonna... Don't die from this. Yes! Oh, she made it. I thought she was cooked. I know you gotta be hurting. That's so- The snow probably helped with the impact, but... We gotta go, though. This is no time to stand around. Woo! Oh, man. That could have been so cooked. Okay. Keep running, Emily. Keep fucking running. That's what I love to see. I love seeing that. She really has that dog in her, like, for real. Oh, we're back at the cabin? Damn, she... She's booking it. Crap. Oh, is this where he thinks he's gonna shoot? Oh, yeah, and then we showed the gunshot earlier. Let her in quick. Is that oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Wait, no, she's at the cabin, though. Yeah. What's going on with Mike? Oh, no. Are you alright? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Are you okay? You we gotta let it catch up for a second, it's lagging. Where is Matt? It's crazy. Wait, a monster? Yeah, fuck M, are you okay? Sorry, I didn't read both. But... Ash, relax, it was Josh, it was all Josh. No, 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 no. listen to me. Shit, it was not Josh. No, it was after me, and it wasn't human. Thank you. Confused what happened, concerned, where is Matt? I don't- I'm sorry, Matt. We don't care. M. Tell us exactly what happened. I am trying to tell you. She doesn't even know we about it. climbing up the tower and it, it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mines. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head. I found oh it. Oh my God. Crazy shit. Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I think they fell down there. 
Oh, Jesus Christ. But the worst part is I don't think that Hannah died, like, from the fall, not right away. Wait, what? What do you mean? I don't know. I feel like she was down there, like, starving to death for weeks when we were all up Hash here looking for her. And we had no idea. Jeez, that's horrible. Thanks, Chris. Listen, in, in the tower, there was, there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Oh, hey, what? You made it. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, Mike. barely. Where did he come from? What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I, she's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. What the fuck is happening? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. It might Sorry, be Jess. Man, who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I know I shouldn't shoot. Okay, you're back. Good. Huh? Oh, it's him. Hey, definitely do not shoot. Mike? Nah, Mike, put put the strap away. Mike had the pistol on the thing, so it was the man give me a pistol or I'll cover the door. You ready? Mike, don't shoot. Just do it already. Whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. <laughs> I got this. True. Don't trust Chris. Don't shoot. Please don't, sh don't shoot. If he shoots, I'm restarting. Oh, God. Damn! Yo, chill out, my guy. You don't even know who you are. Kick in the fucking door. Yo. Take it easy, Grandpa. Crap, okay, Oscar. Everybody, crazy. just calm down. Nah, just move over there. Go on, move. Okay. I'm say what I can Why is say. he being a dick about it? I'm I guess he doesn't like that, man. What you're up against being back on this mound, you should never have returned. We didn't I don't know. know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Or oh, responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain. Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What are they talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. The shit, I'm sorry. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? Mike, if I can spill, I told spill, you. spill it out then, bro. He's guilty as shit. Mike. Guilty as something. Mike. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. Did that man You're just need to find somewhere fucking... Safe. That's a raven, this shit? Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until Ta -da. dawn. <laughs> Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. Okay. No, no he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this map. Nah, he's not dead, I don't think. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out Chris, there, Chris. You, you are not I'm him. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Max. I don't care. Ashley Cook. Then I'll go with you. Okay. I don't need your help. Chris. You're going alone is suicide. Yeah, you're not him, my guy. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. And don't go outside again until we're back. Let's have Sam call you know, the shots here. Okay. understand the magnitude of the situation. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. Mm -hmm. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. Chris, Please you don't gotta me. say you gotta do everything. I tell you, Chris makes every situation difficult, bro. I do not like him. Why did I like him? He's kind of funny sometimes, but that's it. For some reason, the animations are looking very weird right now. Kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me, I know. 
Hey. Ah, sure, Can I come I here. Okay. Oh. Ooh! Hurry, son. I, uh, That's what I'm so talking stupid. about. Finally. So, so, so tell me, you're Shut the expert on these things. What's uh? What, what, what's a guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. How many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? I don't think it does die. Well, you've been shooting it a long time. <laughs> yeah. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, but it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They <sighs> fear it. And it can kill them if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. Okay. Good thing you have the big-ass fucking flamethrower tank. Right, if Mike got here that quick... Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable? Or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some patterns, like any animal or human. Can we talk, why the fuck are they walking like right how, now? Like they've got schedules. Josh could be getting attacked. They only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. <laughs> Again, why are we not I'm running? Not pro Wendigo tips. Hi, right, Chris. Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something. Oh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that. I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. I remember that's <laughs> a big thing. On changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Hey, uh, the door's over here, guy. Uh, well, I don't recommend testing it out. Okay. Unless you have no other choice. Damn it. All right. Josh is so cooked. Oh no. Oh, that blood? Damn it, what happened? Oh, he's dead as fuck. Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Quiet. Oh shit, Josh. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He could still be out. Bro, there. nah, run. First, a Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin. Off of your entire body, piece by piece. I hear one. Go! Alive and aware, and feast on your organs, one piece at a time. One piece. So we'll watch that. I hear one, bro. It's too late. Run! It might still be near. It is. Chris. Chris. Oh my! What do you mean run? Was it not in front of us? Yes, it was. Chris, you have no instincts. Oh, you're pissing me off. Then run. How was I supposed to stop that? It warned me about that. I think I just I think I just cooked. It warned me about that. Maybe that's what it was warning me. Oh my god. I killed him. Okay, who cares? Run! Chris, you're a fucking idiot. Oh my Thank you. Run! Hey, there's nothing I could do about that. There's literally no decision I made. Oh my gosh. Hey, that shit got some knockback. Got knock knockback too on that bitch. Run. Why are you crying? Oh my god, I hate you. Is, there, is this another one or is this the same one? It's still in front of us. Chris, you are so fucking stupid. Bang! What? Huh? Like, shut up! Run. Inside, you fucking idiot! Ash, Ash. Oh, thank God, please let, let me in quick. Is, why is he limping? Like, Chris, oh my God, what happened? We gotta, we gotta go to the so basement. That's what happened. Go, 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 go. 
Ah. Oh. Look at that. Hmm. By the way, did not render him a mobile like he said. It was. Oh, it's Josh! Mmm, Josh. Oh God. So long. Not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... Chopper. He didn't make it? Black no. Rabbit? What happened? The thing, it, uh, it tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. Yeah. All right. Are these all the doors? Yeah. Are Look you at sure? my little kitty. What are you so looking cute? for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. Sure. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I, I Sorry, mean... Sorry, Em. Right? Well, you can I'm wait. listening, I swear. I'm leaving. People what? are no hopefully coming in the morning. They should know. Josh, he's gotta have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great. Great. That fucking thing got a hold of Josh. Then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? It did! I saw some horrible <laughs> stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... All right, what are huh. we going to do about it? It's the real thing. Em? What? Fuck it. I'm going to get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm going to get us all the hell out of here. Okay, Mike. And what is all that? So that old guy's bag. Is that a map? Oh, Off the bag he got. Thing. <laughs> Not quite. Okay. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You have been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Miners? There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. He's so Dried cute. blood all over the place, like somebody'd been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up there. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's that how I got weird. back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um, um, what is, huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, oh it's my nothing. god. It's nothing, it just, it bit me, it bit you, what bit When did it bite her? The Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not. Wait, when did it bite there. her, though? What? It doesn't. Hurt I do remember this, really, but when did that happen? It's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you. I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was yeah, eating don't... each other. Remember, he said eating that. Eating each other? Well, she didn't work. eat yes, anything. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh my uh, God. I don't know if I buy that. I really don't. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike? You got to go. Tweaking. You You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am. Emily, you can't. Nah, I don't agree with this. Mike, just Cool your head, okay? You Thank you. See, this is why I said Sam called the shots. Just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do, and I don't want to see it again. Bro, you guys are so dramatic. You're not even going to do any investigation? The door's right here. That's insane. I am that's... letting you do this voluntarily. That's, f oh, no. that's actually <laughs> insane work. You yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get Is Jasper Lee dead? Whoa. Mike, Whoa. You're gonna shoot me? Mike, what? Mike, this is the safe Chill out. This is what we saw the totem. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. We are not don't shooting her. Us. Hell no. Don't, don't Tweaking. Do Crash out Mike is crazy. Fuck no. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh my god. Bro, we don't I even know. know. I hope you did. Maybe. For now. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, 
You guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. Mike is wild for doing this. What the hell? Yeah, actual okay. tweakers. Don't be mad at Sam. She did nothing wrong. This is awkward. I thought that that he was gonna help us. With a flamethrower, dude? No, we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. Have we played it actually yet? I don't know if we have. Oh god, here we go. Reading time. Only a few men have dared to hunt the Wendigo. This guy's a little Okay, damn. I am the only man who has ever kept them under control. Heed these words or it shall be your death. And your death will not be the last. The Wendigo must be contained. The Wendigo grows out of cannibalism. When a human is desperate and craves food trapped on the mountain in the fierce winter storm. When he has eaten nothing for many days, the Wendigo spirit will begin to possess him. Even the strongest man is weak to it. He will kill without remorse. Often those con companions who have traveled with him, he will eat... The flesh raw from the corpses. I've seen this happen many years ago. A craving for flesh that cannot be sated. And then the change begins. The eyes turn first and become milky and white. Then the teeth become longer like fangs. The creature grows and the skin is pulled tout across the bones. Ugh. Oh god. There was a tribe that lived in these mountains. The Cree. Their shamans tell stories of a tall creature born in ice. There's a history to this. Thanks, I was reading. The tribe respected the mountain and all the animals which lived on it. The mountain became sacred to the Cree. Every animal became sacred also. The Cree believed it was bad luck to harm an anim animal on the mountain it would hunt elsewhere. In, 19 in 1839, the miners arrived. They found tin and later traces of radium. They mined deep into the sacred mountain. The Cree say that the mountain cried out and the spirit was released. The Wendigo's eyes change. They become sharper and more dim. The Wendigo this sees movement. Because the Wendigos are mutated from humans. When they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. Ah. I didn't even get to read that part, you bit. The Wendigo sees movement. It's a hunter like a hawk, but it cannot see stillness. If you are able to keep totally still, then the Wendigo will not be able to see you. The skin and flesh of the Wendigo are hard like armor. They seem to feel no pain, but they cannot be cut or stabbed. Bullets will not pierce their skin, though a shotgun will keep them at bay. Because the Wendigo is mutated from a human, it knows how to hunt us. It can perfectly mimic its prey. You must remain sharp and disciplined. I've killed six Wendigos. Knives or bullets will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. It is the best weapon. Fire envelops them, burns away their skin, and makes them weak. But try not to kill them. Killing a Wendigo should be the last resort. Death releases the Wendigo spirit into the air. Wow. I've contained them. I've used traps to catch them in fire to drive them into cages. The traps were baited from human limbs... From those who had no farther use for them. One by one I caught those who had infested the mountain. Wow. That's why. So there's just a cage for them somewhere. There may be defensive. Shamans wrote of rituals. I have found native artifacts on the mountain and copied them. Totems, bunches, and herbs and feathers. I copied their designs. I've tested them out on the mountain. They work. They keep the wind to go at bay. Not entirely, but enough. But inside the buildings, they do not work. So that's what the to that's why there's totems around. That's crazy. Why does it not work inside buildings? What? Okay. Cree legends say that the Wendigo grows from the bite of another Wendigo. But the bite is harmless. I have been bitten, but I did not change. The only way to eat the only way is to eat the flesh of another. There is no other way. Okay. So Emily's fine. Uh, We're not gonna say anything? Yeah, come on. No, 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 no. Are you okay? We just got good news. Reassure you sure Em you'll be okay? Conceal just crazy stuff in here. Why would we not reassure Em you'll be fine? It says that... Like, what are these options sometimes? The bites. It, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Okay, why is she saying it like it's a problem? Sorry, what did you say? Um, it says you'll be okay. It says what? Okay, are you guys like on acid? What's okay, happening? Michael almost shot me. Is that fine? Let me show you. And this bitch almost let him. Okay, That's let's so chill scared. out. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry. I'm Why sorry. does she have to be the victim? It's like, oh no, I had it worse. There's no excuse. There's no excuse, please, Emily. Emily. Please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Squeaking. 
Emily, what the fuck? This is why no one likes you. Talk to M. Fuck that trophy. Like now. Why? Why? What? I'm not gonna lie. Don't think I heard where Mike went. Sorry. Oh, Joshua. You should have oh, we're back. Yeah. Where are we now? People have died. I don't know is Jess actually words, dead? What the actively fuck? Actively triggering events that lead to someone's death or passively allowing a tragedy to occur because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Josh is just cooked in general. Remember last year? Huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? Okay, you that's a little... That's a little harsh. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Oh, he's on my bed. My little baby. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can I you feel, kind of feel how bad cold form. your loneliness has become? He literally got driven insane because his sister died. Sisters died. I think that's so Why sad. Did you hurt them? His friends Joshua, fucking killed his sister. Did you hurt them? <laughs> did it hurt anyone or they hurt me? He didn't physically hurt anyone. Well, fuck it. They hurt me. But they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake. That's true. And a terrible tragedy befell you. That's that's valid. That's you valid. Did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night it's of very horrific true. torture. It's very true. Let Hill cook. I'm so sorry, or it was just a game. Yeah, bro, we gotta feel sorry. Oh, Come on. But it's not too late for atonement. A second chance! And that's your friends, if they still are your friends. Oh, shit! You from. So we actually have a chance to save him. It's terrible. Okay. Isolation. Maybe Josh can step out of this. Some medicine, some therapy, you know. He was a normal guy at one point, kind of. Is that the end of the chapter? Should have taken his time loading. Okay. Um. So I think we only have two more episodes left, really. We are going to end it here. It was kind of a shorter chapter. Been recording for about 42-ish minutes. Um. That was very eventful, though. You know, a lot of shit happened. We really got to scrap with the Wendigo. Uh, so that's pretty cool. I'm actually gonna be very upset if Jess is dead because I don't understand what I did wrong. Maybe I missed something that I needed, like the fucking flare gun. I'm gonna have beef with this flare gun forever. Yeah, let's hope Jess is dead. I think I've really only killed Matt. I don't know who else I could have been at fault for, really. So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the notification bell for part 8? Yeah. Uh, yeah, and I'll see you guys in that video. Peace.